G'day all, it's Colin from PCTLC and thanks for joining me. Um, I'm in my Linux Mint Cinnamon desktop here and I just thought I would uh, share a little idea that I use with folder colours. So um, I didn't ever think I would find a use for these but uh, I did and I thought I would just share it. Um, so what I've got here is uh, my original recordings. So these are all my recordings. These ones I haven't got folders for. Very early ones I started off with, but now I do everything in folders. And this is my backup disk for my original recordings. Um, probably don't need them once I've edit edited the recording, but it's just best to keep them anyway, just in case. So what I actually do is, um, when I actually copy this folder, onto my backup disk, like so. Just wait for the disk to um, fire up. <clears throat> and I believe that's probably copied over already. Um, now, what I do here is I mark that red. So I know that um, that particular item there has been copied and backed up. It's got a different colour. The green ones have not been done yet. So I'll copy that and paste it there. Because uh, I, was, I do a lot of manual backups. Now, um, it can get very overwhelming with a lot of, you know, you get involved with making videos and you just, you know, put them in the folder and and then you think, oh, what have I backed up and what, I, what haven't I backed up? So I figured that uh, these little colours here um, are a good way to know that you've actually backed up that folder. So yeah, the cons would be that uh, you're manually backing up everything. And yeah, you've got to um, manually change the folder colours. But this way is a better way than... Um, than uh, not knowing at all, especially if they're all the same colour and you don't really know whether you've backed up, backed it up or not. So, and um, and yeah, I suppose the other con would be you've got to make a folder for everything, but I find folders much easier to, um, oops, wrong colour. I find folders a lot easier to deal with. Um, so if everything's got a folder, um, then you can just um, copy that over, change the colour, you know it's been done. So um, I don't know if they exist in uh, the GNOME desktop, I have to have a look, but um, that actually uh, comes in very handy for me. This one here is my new videos, so um, that's where this video is going. And then once I'm done, I'll move it into here. I'll, I'll create a folder, move it into here. It'll be green, and I know that that folder would not have been uh, backed up yet. So um, I just thought I would um, just share that little idea that I have using folder colours. Um, it's a great idea to know that you've backed everything up. So instead of using um, some sort of backup manager, um, if and, and speaking of backup managers, I'm not sure, I don't use them. I've looked at a few, but um, I suppose uh, the, the best one would be that all it does is just sync your folders so once you put a new one in there it syncs it and it's there so and I think um, there is one that does that and I can't remember the name of it right now but um, yeah but I find this uh, for manual backups this is a great idea because um, then you you know that you've uh, you don't have to remember that you've done it you can clearly see that it has been done so uh, I hope you liked my little uh, folder colour idea there. Hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching.